Okay, folks, today I want to talk about a suction accumulator. This is a part that's in all heat pumps. You want to also put these in if you have an excessive long line set. We generally put these in in our commercial jobs, especially seven and a half ton or larger, when you have line sets one inch or larger to catch excess refrigerant. In this case, this came out of a large heat pump. I believe this was a five ton. I want to talk to you how the refrigerant works. It comes in, comes out this baffle, and the refrigerant swirls around and goes in this meter device, pulls through the meter device and goes up. Now I'm going to explain that in a little more detail, but first thing I want to tell you is why you have a suction accumulator. You have a suction accumulator to prevent slugging back to the compressor because if liquid gets back in the compressor it damages the crankshaft, it damages the scroll compressor, it washes out the oils, you don't have no oil, it burns them up and they fail. So this accumulator is a very important item to have. Now what happens with your refrigerant, it comes in as a low pressure vapor it comes out, the, the vapor swirls around, the liquid swirls around, there's going to be some liquid in here, there's going to be some oil. The liquid and the oil is going to settle to the bottom, it's going to fill up, and what's going to happen, this here is a metering device. This metering device will pull in the refrigeration oil and the little bit of refrigerant vapor as the compressor can tolerate, it's going to pull it up and it's going to very fastly go up through here and go out to the compressor as a low pressure vapor. Just remember, you go into the compressor as a low pressure vapor, it comes out of the compressor as a high pressure vapor. That's, that's generally how an accumulator works. Let me point out one more thing about accumulators. These things sweat a lot. They get rusty very easy. See how this one here is rusted? What you need to do is every once in a while when you guys are doing your maintenances and you homeowners are doing your, your cleaning, take some sandpaper, clean this up, and really paint this thing. Paint this thing very thoroughly because you see it's nothing but a steel container. If you have any questions, if you have any problems, anything at all about suction accumulators, give us a call at Jones Air Conditioning and Electrical, 239-596-58. Bye-bye.